Jason. I am the front desk, which we call a poster for American Queen Steamboat Company. Um, I started this job back in 2013. I love it. My best part of the job is my job. Um, meeting new people and find a way and an answer to everybody's needs. Um, yeah, and Miss Betty is one of the people that really makes a difference <laughs> here on our cast and crew. She always has a smile. She remembers everyone's name, all 400 passengers, <laughs> I think she knows by name, and she makes every one of us feel special. Thank you, Miss Betty. Thank you. It's my pleasure. <laughs>
and just seeing the world and being brave and just meeting new people all the time. I really admire that about you, Jean. Well, I've enjoyed meeting you, Sandy and Jerry as well, and Marilyn and John and Ralph. Ralph's a dear. <laughs> he is. He's lovely to talk to. Well, it's all going very well. And the next time I roast a pumpkin, I'll think of you. <laughs> <laughs> I keep roasting pumpkins. Look up the pumpkin scone recipe and see what happens. Great. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. About, about the people that come on board for me. Uh, they, they feed me energy and they make it so much fun and they make every week very different and unique and there's always special people every week. It's, it's just a real thrill for me to, to be the cruise director on board the American Queen. Thank you, Alex. And Alex is one of the special people in this little video documentary because of who he is. He touches each passenger you can see how good he makes eye contact with this silly iPad. No looking <laughs> away. This is one of his special traits. He really looks at a person when he speaks to them. And you feel really important. For that moment that he's caught your attention, you feel like the center of the world and that your happiness is the most important thing to him. Shears. I'm 51 years old. I've been on the boat for three years. I love my job. The reason why I love my job is because I love people. I make them happy. I make them feel at home and I make them feel very, very comfortable. Великолепное обслуживание. Мы очень рады, что мы попали на этот тур, что дочка с мужем придумали такую идею вот, нас пригласить. Мы хотели бы еще раз поплавать на таком корабле. Thank you. And Olga, I'm glad in you. Нам очень нравится. They, they like it. Okay. They and now, Vaselina is going to translate the cliff notes of what Mama Olga said. We were here. Mom said that they came from Russia mm -hmm. and they are invited by myself and my husband to meet my husband's parents. We had a couple celebrations going on their anniversary for the, for the year. And how many years? 40. 40. Oh, yes. We had a celebration on my birthday. Uh, oh. I'm not going to say how long, how much. <laughs> oh, you're I very guess. young. Uh, <laughs> and yeah, they really like it. They really
Who? <laughs> yeah. Booyah. And you are Carol, We're Carol and, Eric. and Eric Lauren. We're originally from the Boston area, although I just retired and we've moved up to the White Mountains of New Hampshire. Oh. And we are here with our son and his wife and her parents who are over from Russia. And so, if anyone was thinking about doing a river boat cruise, what would you say? So we've done three, and this is our third one. So, sure, do it. It's great, it's wonderful. You can see if you're afraid of the ocean, do a river boat cruise because you can see the sides and it's not so intimidating. Um, and they're all good, and you always eat too much. <laughs> Very relaxing. Uh huh. Too much food, but very relaxing. And I uh, would encourage anybody to give it a try. <laughs> okay, one thing that you would tell Michael and Vaselina uh, if you knew they would watch it in five years. Yeah, just always so take really good care of each other. Always. Family first is all I'd say. And I think they know that already, but yeah. and we'll remind them. <laughs> we believe it. Works for us. Perfect. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you. you. So this is Miss Sandra from the Emporium, one of my favorite people here on the American Queen. She tried to teach me how to speak Southern, and she's going to teach you how to do it. Okay. In order to speak Southern, it's just a matter of turning it down a little notch and making it sound a little syrupy because here down south we speak really very slow and you know when you say how you doing normally it's two words but here down south it's how you doing so maybe one day Sandra will get, a, uh, get the knack of that, but it's just a matter of turning it down a notch, making it sound real sweet. And you are really <laughs> sweet. You are one of my favorite people here. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye. I get weary and sick of trying. I'm tired of living and scared.